Church say amen. Amen again. Amen. Once more for the Holy Ghost. Greetings, yeah. giving honor to God who is the head of my life, in the name above all names. I bring you greetings from the St. Luke Tabernacle Community Church in Rochester, New York. It is a wonderful, wonderful honor and privilege to be here with you today. I want to acknowledge the angel of this house, the Reverend Dr. Christopher Bullock. Amen. Sister Debbie, in her absence, we want to recognize her. And all of you, this, this wonderful choirs that singing sisters and this great music ministry. I want to recognize and thank all of you for what you do, for all of the ministers and trustees and deacons, officers, members and friends of Canaan. It is a great honor and a pleasure to be here with you today. I feel, um, I was born and bred a Baptist. But I've always had these Pentecostal moments that we're having <laughs> from time to time. So it's good to be in a place where we know every now and then we have a Pentecostal moment. We come from time to time to welcome the move of the Spirit in this place. Amen. Amen. It's good to be here. I'm, I, I'm, I'm a little nervous, which is um, why I'm trying to figure out how to get to what to say, what I'm going to say. Um, but I asked, I asked, uh, I asked Dr. Strickland Jones uh, this morning if she would sing a little something for me to put me at ease. Now I'm going to ask her to do something again, not the same one. Uh, but I, I just go back to these songs that they used to sing at the Second Gethsemane Missionary Baptist Church on the corner of Lafayette in Mount Elliot in Detroit, Michigan, where the Reverend James H. Evans Sr. was the pastor. And those saints would sing songs that would bring me into the presence of God in a very powerful way. And uh, if you could do just a verse, because the Lord did not bless me with Pastor Bullock's voice, so <laughs> you could do a verse of the Lord will make a way somehow. All right, anybody know that? Like a ship that's tossed 